Are you ready for this? Hit the music. We have fitted you out with a brand new interior. Just check that out. Those chairs are real leather. And the steering wheel? The steering wheel was hand carved by a Greek god out of an antler's horn. Don't believe me? It doesn't matter. It's yours. Next up, we have the rims. I know what you're thinking. You can't see them. Well, I guess we forgot to put them on. But let's forget about that. Let's come to the backside of the car where the real magic happens. Yeah, I'm talking 32-inch exhaust. Wait, did he say 28-inch exhaust? Hell no, I didn't. I said 32 inches of pure power. We got some nice taillights up in here. But most importantly, we got the carbon fiber spoiler that is gonna triple your airtime wait what do i mean airtime baby this car can fly okay it can't fly but i am gonna show you how to make this amazing sports car in just a few easy steps uh don't worry about that that was nothing hey guys it's wait what i could have sworn they were literally right there that is so strange oh there you are hi as you guys have already read from the title, you know what is about to go down. And that is that I am going to be creating a drivable, steerable sports car inside of Build a Boat in Roblox. And guys, this is the boat car thing that we're going to be making today. As you can see from the introduction, it literally has everything you could ever want. And like I said, it is drivable. You could actually turn this car around. Wait, you don't believe me? Let's take it for a spin. So as you guys can see, literally right now on the screen, I am controlling the way the car goes. Like literally, I could go over to this island if I want right now and just, you know, drive all over this person's front garden. Oh, uh, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to run your flowers over. Oh, geez, this is getting out of control. Only joking, this thing is so easily controllable, guys. Okay, I crashed. Okay, but yes, guys, I can literally drive this now straight through to the end. I mean, it hasn't got like an amazing defense, but it's definitely a worth learning to build because i mean just look how cool it looks everyone is gonna think you're like so cool if you're driving this about in fact let me find the blue flag uh because that has three people on it and let's go see what they think of my car okay so i've just asked them do you like my car he's saying yes see is it cool can i buy it lol see he even wants to buy my car he's saying it's cool it's gotta be cool it also has two seats in the back for passengers if you want to take them along with you just like this see now i've got myself a passenger but like i said guys it doesn't do that amazing when you actually go through but it's more for driving around and just looking cool so yeah let me show you how to do this so here we go guys i am back at my base where i'm going to be building my supercar i just want to say if you guys do enjoy this video i'm also going to build a house because i think that's another really cool option for us guys to do but uh yeah let's get on with building the car so before we begin this tutorial there's one thing i must stress at the beginning and that is that you need to come to the shop and you have to buy this right here it's 900 gold and it gives you all of the things you need to make a car but even if you buy this it doesn't mean you can actually make a car because you know you've actually got to know how to make the car work otherwise it won't actually run it will just sit there so i'm going to show you exactly how to do it so once you've bought that guys simply press 2 which opens up the build option as you can see right here and then get yourself some blocks if you haven't got any and you can't afford any then you need to start building terrible boats that will take you through and get you coins so you can come to the shop and buy stuff just like this and it will give you loads of amazing blocks so if you've already got some blocks and you're just like me, then you're ready to begin building. So I'm going to make one off the top of my head, which is based off the one that you just saw. And uh, yeah, it's incredibly easy to make. So listen carefully. The first thing that we're going to do is build like a base for the car. So we're going to make the floor of the car before we do anything else, because this is the most easy bit and the bit that we need to start with so guys to begin this tutorial we're going to need to start by putting the basics down which is a floor every car needs a floor otherwise you just fall through the bottom so what i'm going to do is i'm going to start by building a square i'm going to do literally three across like that and then three in front so i literally use nine blocks just like that one two three one two three just like that then, guys, do another two forward, so you've done a five by three block, just like that. And as long as it looks like this right now, you're doing a good job. Then what you want to do is come down to the bottom and find this thing right here. Make sure that you put it around the right way. Make sure the gray side isn't at the back and is actually at the front 
just like this. Again, guys, just pause the video if you need to. I'm going to walk around so you can get a good look at how I'm doing this, just in case you find it hard to follow along. I'm just going to go slow for some of those guys that literally, you know, they might have a slower PC. But uh, yeah, I'm going to move on to the next thing now, which is to put two back wheels on. So you can pretty much put these where you want, though I'm going to put mine right near the back. In fact, that's wrong. I'm going to do it one block away from the back. So if that's one block, I want to put it right there, just like that. I'm then going to do it the same on the other side, just like that. And then I need to put some more blocks down before I can continue. So I'm just going to get these blocks again here. And I'm going to put one literally uh, there, one there. And then I'm going to do one in the middle, just like this. Next, guys, I'm going to put my other wheels on now and the ends here, just like this. Guys, right now, your car should be looking exactly like this. If it does, you're doing a fantastic job. If it doesn't, again, guys, pause the video if you need to. I'm going to stand in as many directions as possible for you guys to follow along. Now, as long as you're looking like this, you want to come back and get a few more blocks out because now what we want to do is fill out the sides a bit kind of like uh, this by like joining them up to here, if that makes sense. So I'm going to do that along each side just like this. And what this will do is fatten out my sides so that if I do crash, then at least it's not going to be a bad crash just like that. You know what? I'm actually going to remove these two because I think it looks better without them. Next, guys, we want to do a test real quick, and we want to see if our car is going to match up. So what we do is we put the chair where we want it, and we need all of these white lines to attach. So one to each tire, and also if you look very carefully, one to the bottom down here as well. If it attaches to that, then you've done a good job, and you'll be able to steer your car. Now, as long as you've got the base plate down, from this point on, it's pretty much up to you. But I know you guys, you want me to show you exactly how to make it look like a sports car. So the next step that I recommend that you do is start building up. And you're probably thinking, well, how do I do it? Guys, that's what I'm here for. I'm going to choose a different color than what I used before because last time it was a bit bland. So I'm going to add some white this time, just like that, by putting three blocks on the side of the car like this. Next, I'm going to do the same thing at the back. I'm just going to come over to the back and probably put one there and one there and one there, just like that. Though, if I wanted to, I could easily bring these forward like this. Especially if you want to put passengers in the back, then you're going to kind of need to do that and just like that as well. Now, if you're putting passengers in the back, you'll need to get these chairs and simply just put two or three in the back. It's entirely up to you. I'm just going to put uh, two in the back just like that so I can bring two passengers with me. If you guys don't have the chairs, it's not a problem. They're very easy to get. You just need to go to the shop and buy one of these two following crates, which again, guys, you need to earn coins to buy. Now, if your car is looking just like this, you're doing a cracking job. Oh, by the way, hi, dude. He just waved at me. Oh, wait, he's pointing at my car. It must be a cool car, right? But yes, guys, if you made it this far, what you now need to do is the more difficult bit, which is to put the windows in. So, guys, like I say, this is kind of just like playing about with it till you get what you want. But I'm pretty much just going to put windows around almost the whole thing. So I'm going to do three on the side, three on the front and three on the back. And there we go. That's where I want all my windows to go, and I want them to look good just like that. Guys, if you want, remember, you can literally leave these bits open if you want to have a way of getting in or making it look a bit cooler or different, at least. What I'm now going to do is I need to remove this quickly just by coming to the destroy tool, remove this and this only for a second because I need to put my engine in. So once you've removed that, guys, you need to come to your engine, which is right here, rotate it by pressing R and put it where you want it. I'm putting mine like like that. Then guys, just simply fill in around your engine what you destroyed just a second ago. Make sure that you put it all in the right place. You do not want to put it in the wrong place because it just won't look good. And yeah, it should look something like that. I'm then going to add a block underneath both these pieces of glass just like that because I need something to attach my spoilers. Now for the spoiler guys, the way I decided to do it was using these balloon things here. I would just put one there and one there just like that. And then I would use these tall grey blocks that I have here and I would sort of just try and sit them on this like this and also on the other side just like that and then using the steel beam which is what this was I'm just going to attach these like this and that is the easiest way of making a spoiler though if you don't like the look of it you can also obviously change the way it is but as long as it looks something like that you're doing a good job I mean if you want you can bring this back out a bit which is exactly what I'm going to do I'm just going to grab my uh, launcher here and whatever this is called. I think it's like your exhaust or whatever. I'm just going to bring it out so it sticks out the back a bit because I think it just looks better when it's sticking out the back. Maybe not that far, 
but maybe one more in kind of like but maybe something like that just so it just sticks out the back and that looks really cool to me but i'm gonna have my spoiler looking something like this so all i've done there is drop that down a little bit and uh yeah it looks pretty cool now it's been dropped down and it's a bit lower but the car is not finished so guys i like to have my race car as a convertible so it has no roof on it but obviously if you want to have a roof you can have a roof so what i recommend doing before you do that is to come over here grab these poles and put them on each corner just like this as long as they're roughly uh you know symmetrical like those two are it's gonna look good maybe put one at the back here as well and also one at the back just here like that alternatively what you can do is get some of these blocks and just put them in there which is what i'm gonna do for this case just like that because i didn't do this last time and then what i'm also going to do is leave this bit open this time and just put one block right there by my feet so that it stops anything coming in and hitting me next guys what i recommend you do is you get these things right here which i don't know what they are and you put them on the front like that and it will give you like headlights though you should be able to just move them in a little bit just to make them look a bit better because you could put them on the end or you could put them one in and i think it just looks so much better if they come one in like that i'm also going to come to the back over here and stick them on the bottom just like that uh, but the other way around so they're black then using my existing balloons which I have left I'm just going to add some details so I could put these anywhere I'm going to put them here and here and that just gives a nice little detail for the car and pretty much guys that is it if you want to change anything that is entirely up to you but this is a working race car that you can literally show all your friends and you could just be cool like i said you can give it a roof you can also add a bit more to the front if you want to literally like this maybe just you know stick something there stick something i don't know like over here just literally like block the front up so you could actually have like the front covered also you could have a roof literally like this and literally do whatever you want with it i don't want a roof though i like the look without the roof i think it looks a bit sportier i also don't really like that at the front i just want it to look sports car like you know but yes guys that is going to be it from me today if you guys did enjoy this video remember to hit the like button so that i know that you enjoyed this and then i will make the house tutorial as well or anything else that you want to see remember to hit the subscribe button what are you waiting for alternatively leave a comment or suggestion in the comment section down below and i will see you all in the next one bye now i gotta learn how to make a house in this oh i crashed